Hello everybody. Uh, today I continue with uh, uh, how to customize the list view item with column and row. Uh, so in the previous lesson we uh, use a list type, but in some time, but sometimes the list type is not enough for you to customize your list item. And in this lesson we continue by customize the list item using uh, column and row. We use uh, between column and row. Uh, which column and row is important? No, uh, it is the same. You must use. Uh, sometimes you use column, but sometimes you also use row. So uh, the row and column is the same important and uh, very useful when you want to customize a complicated use interface. So here we have the try, uh, the, the try here, uh, firstly I add it to a row. The row means from red left to right, yes. We have a row here and uh, the, the which is from left to right, yeah. Uh, quite a, uh, straightforward and quite clearly to understand. So now I copy this uh, uh, here, the list time, the content of the list time, and I, I paste to here. So I copy the price uh, with style, and, uh, and I also copy and paste to here. Yes, okay. So we have two text, two text, and the text here I add inside a row. So remove this unnecessary and you can reload again yes so we have a uh, name and price yes but it's not good so now you have to customize you have to customize this uh, so we can add more we add a column here a column mean uh, it contains the, the, the component of the widgets from up to down from top to bottom Yes. Okay, so I add the, uh, the, 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 the custom here and inside the custom we, we have two uh, text and uh, the main axis alignment is the align for column. Yes. So start mean from top and, uh, and the main axis alignment from start mean from left. Yeah, the cross axis alignment is left. Yes. So here you can add more padding to this. So if you want to add more padding, uh, you can. Uh, okay, you must add a text here. You must add more text here. I I want to add the amount uh, and the, maybe the amount is the right. And the text here is uh, date time. So I want to add the date or the time you, 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 you buy an item. When you buy a computer or buy a laptop, it saves your time to build. Or the time uh, here is uh, the date time at the specific or at this time you buy the item. Yes. So you want, I, I want to add more fill inside uh, under existing transaction, so uh, you add created date property inside the transaction. You add it more inside the transaction. Okay, so uh, you can call, uh, you can assign the created date to the current date using date time dot now. Yes. Date time dot now. Now is a static function of the class this time, and it gets the current date time. The, it gets the current date time. Okay, so it pays the current date time here. Okay, and uh, you you can you can also use the e uh, intl library for more detail about this time the time, and you use the date time format dot. Uh, year Monday uh, so the two string the convert to string to display okay yes and now you 
make bigger and test so buy a laptop and the amount here is $1,200 yeah okay so we have two text in a column and here it is outside the, uh, uh, outside the, 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 the column and inside the row inside the row but outside the column yes. and, I, and now I want the 2000 in the right or at the end how to do this uh, how to do this to make it at the end to move it to the end and there are a way to do this there are many ways to do this but uh, now I can use a, an, uh, a component like expanded or widgets like expanded okay but firstly you must change the main axis of alignment means the, the, the main alignment is from left to right and the cross axis alignment is from top to bottom so if I can if I change this to start here yeah, no change uh, if I change this to end I re add to the right and, and I add a padding inside uh, the children of row so I add the padding to uh, yeah so the, the padding okay uh, add inset dot all and I set a value for uh, up down left right for four paddings yes okay yes okay so we can see the padding for left and right uh, the left and right padding so I can use it uh, the the padding for row I can yeah, I customize the padding for row yes okay the company for row yes and now I change a little bit I change so I string I, I, I string string to cut mm, and I, I change the cut to container uh, I replace the cut container and try here yes and now I can add a padding and just set uh, symmetric for example vertical vertical mean top and uh, bottom top and bottom mean uh, uh, vertical symmetric symmetric yes okay so the vertical here symmetric up 10 and down 10 okay and command s to save and test so some problem no Okay, are there any problem? No, okay. And uh, container, yes, maybe cart. Okay. So remove container, yes. No problem. Maybe something wrong. The row. Uh, so here yeah, you can add more padding inside uh, the children of uh, column you can add more padding uh, by padding add inset only top okay yes yes top and uh, top and bottom uh, the same way maybe a better bottom may be better and uh, now you can add a, a more but uh, more padding uh, at the at the bottom of the text, okay. So good, maybe maybe it is okay now for you to see the interface. So what about the money amount? The money amount two thousand and uh, one thousand and two hundred dollars. How to add this? So I use the expanded widgets. The expanded widget will uh, get the remain size of the parent which is uh, so the remain size I use the remain size and inside the expanded we uh, we will change uh, the alignment I, I change the, the alignment of the expanded to uh, 
here so we have chai here I, I want to move this to the right by using expanded okay chai and here I, I use a row and the children we paste to we paste the text to the children and I and I align uh, and I main axis alignment I set the main axis alignment of the row to main axis alignment dot n yes dot n is better okay dot n okay so you can set it dot n uh, and uh, the children main dot n and you can add more padding yes no cannot add padding how how to use how to use so add padding below the text and the padding uh, padding or padding or the size box is okay I use a padding about at the set dot uh, only left or right okay left right is no problem 10 pixel okay so we have 10 pixel at the right okay so now test again now test again by a coffee and 20, uh, 12 okay so we have a two item when you add the content here by computer see your mouse here add to here yes okay so now I can style for more okay so expand it here is very good for you to uh, customize and you can also customize using container uh, yes you can use a container you add a container for uh, the transaction amount and using the box decoration the box decoration and FS mount to here border on set the border for uh, up down left right uh, yeah so here I can use container to customize the money uh, using uh, we adding more border we add more style of border we add border box customization at box my setting okay so we have uh, the result like here okay and uh, beside border we can customize the border radius about 10 pixel to set the border radius yes border radius uh, make your text more clearly yes and you can set the width about the width of the border for the border width the border width here is around five uh, three yes okay very very big no no and the border here is two okay and the style and the border style solid okay good so it is quite a nice you can uh, uh, use multiple uh, kind to layout so thanks for watching and see you next time bye bye